So, I'm not really gonna talk about my time in NXT. Overall, it was great, but I don't wanna give Rhea Ripley the attention after what she did. She could have ended my career before it even started. I still think you should have changed your name to Red Eye after that. And think of the marketing opportunities for airlines and allergy medicine that would have come your way. You left a lot of money on the table. Can you focus on our speech instead of bringing up bad ideas from the past? Bad ideas? There's another tie-in you missed out on. Please come in and save me from my idiot best friend. Hey, soon-to-be Hall of Famers. It's my old tag partner. That didn't last very long, did it? Unfortunately, no. I just wanted to say that I am so excited and honored to induct you tonight. We wouldn't want anyone else to do it. I mean, Undertaker would have been pretty cool. Or President Rock. He actually texted us today. Check it out. Can you please stop insulting Rhonda before she snaps your arm off? It's fine. Oh, now I can't find the text. Please tell me I didn't accidentally delete it. Rhonda's the perfect person to induct us. She and I had some intense battles when I first got into WWE. Especially that Money in the Bank match with the arm bar on top of the ladder. I am definitely going to mention that tonight. And I have to tell that story about Trey's first night on Raw. That was crazy. Do you think messages from the president self-destruct? Like, for security reasons? I don't know about that. Oh, I almost forgot. This was on your door. See you out there soon. What is it? It's a note from my parents. You haven't talked to them in years. No, my real parents. It says they're going to be at the Hall of Fame ceremony tonight. Wow, I, I can't believe it. I can't believe it either. Between never hearing from them again after they sent me that letter in high school and then all those times I left tickets for them and they didn't show, I'd, I'd given up hope. But now I'm finally going to meet my actual real parents. This is so cool. Are you sure it's not some kind of misunderstanding? It, it has to be them. Look, they signed it the same way they signed the letter I got in high school. This really isn't the best time, but maybe we should talk about this whole thing with your birth parents. No. You can't do this! What's there to talk about? They must have finally seen me on TV and tracked me down, which is all thanks to you. You're the one who encouraged my big debut on Raw, remember? That's like your third plate. Are you sure you don't have a tapeworm? It's just the food here at Raw is so much better than what I'm used to at NXT. Do you try these black beans? They really nailed the seasoning. I'm good. Don't want a case of the bean cramps during my Money in the Bank qualifying match tonight against Ronda Rousey. Mm. You're lost. I mean, don't get me wrong. There are reasons other than the food that I'd like to join you here on Raw. It's been kind of weird in NXT by myself. Well, whenever you're done stuffing your face, it wouldn't hurt if you made the rounds mm. here and introduced yourself. Never know what could happen. You know what? That's a great idea. I'll do that right now. And by the time I'm done, dessert should be out. Sure, I'll clean up your plate. Hey, where are you going? That goes out to the arena. Finally, you all have a champion you can be proud of. And now that I've climbed this mountain, I plan on enjoying the view for a very, very long time. In fact, our GM Randy Orton might not like me saying this, but I'm the champ now, so who cares? The next decade of Monday Night Raw is going to be very monotonous because there will be no universal title changes. For the next 500 episodes, this is all you will see. Me in this ring holding this championship. Guys, are you seeing this? Unfortunately, yes. I'm not sure why Trey from NXT is here, but let's focus on our champion. Not the reaction I was expecting, but for those of you who find this upsetting, I'm sure there are other so-called championship matches you can watch where the titles will change hands frequently, but not mine. Okay, this guy's officially insane. Security, do your jobs. Are you kidding me? Uh, I saw him visiting backstage, but I guess he had other plans. Are you lost? You know this is an NXT, right? Let him in the ring. 
It's cool. Come on, Joe. You're giving him what he wants. This guy craves the spotlight. You mind telling me what you're doing out here? I think we'd all like to know. I got some really good advice from my friend Red. She's kind of new to Raw, but I'm sure you know who she is, right? Super talented. Bit of a temper sometimes, but you can relate. Anyway, she said I should go around and introduce myself, and I figured, why not start with the Universal Champion himself? So I'm Trey. Pleasure to meet you. I'm not sure this is going to end well for Trey. Do you think I'm some kind of joke? No, no, not at all. Shut your mouth before I break your arm. I didn't plan on competing tonight, but after your little interruption, I guess I'm going to have to start my decade of dominance one week early. I wasn't planning on competing tonight either. I actually just ate a ton of food at catering and my stomach's killing me. You mind if we postpone until next week? I'm afraid that is not an option. Okay, fine. But if I'm doing this, your, your title's on the line, right? <laughs> sure. I didn't get to properly introduce myself. I'm Samoa Joe, the man who's gonna choke the life out of you. We have an impromptu Universal Championship match coming up next. I think it's gonna be more of a slaughter than a match. I'm afraid you're right, Corey. We've seen Trey do some great things in NXT, but I don't think he's ready for this kind of challenge, especially with no time to prepare. Yeah, well, it's too late now. This is happening, and I can't wait. I don't think this is gonna last very long. Unfortunately, I have to agree. Schoolboy out of nowhere. Plenty of fight left. Definitely has his work cut out for him. Wasn't expecting that. Samoa Joe locks in the Coquina clutch. Told you it wasn't gonna last very long. Wait a second. Trey counters. Joe's shoulders are down on the map. He did it. Women are the Universal Champion. Trey just pulled off one of the biggest upsets this isn't over in yet. WWE history. I guess I was still right about it not lasting long, but this is unbelievable. All hell is broken loose on Raw, and we have a NXT superstar who just won the Universal Championship. This is unprecedented. What happens I'm next? Make you pay. Other than Trey running for his life, I have no idea. <laughs> Wait! Can't slow down. Joe's gonna kill me. Shouldn't have eaten all that food. What the hell did you just do? I took your advice and it worked. I'm Universal Champion! I meant you should talk to someone like the GM to try and get a call up. Not interrupt Samoa Joe. I, I mean, congrats. Your crazy way of doing things worked yet again. But now what? I haven't thought that far ahead. I'm just enjoying the moment. Also, I might throw up. <sighs> also, you're my ride. Sorry! If you find your friend before I do, you tell him this is far from over. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Punta Vedra Beach, Florida, L. Guys, this one promises to be absolutely amazing. But as they say, promises are made to be broken, Michael. Though in this case, I think we're safe. Seems to me, guys, like she is incredibly proud of what she's been able to accomplish as of late. She should be proud, Michael. It's not easy to do what she's been able to do but she also has to be careful not to become complacent. The baddest woman on the planet! And from Venice, California, the baddest woman on the planet, Rowdy Ronda! 
It absolutely amazes me how quickly and seamlessly Ronda Rousey made her transition from the world of mixed martial arts to WWE. She improves each and every time she steps in the ring. A real natural. Ronda Rousey! Ronda Rousey! Not that there are any easy matches in WWE, Rousey! but this is a, certainly a tough draw for Red in this Money in the Bank qualifying match. Oh, I agree, Michael. Having to defeat Ronda Rousey just to get a chance to compete in the Money in the Bank ladder match is no easy task. Well, it's kind of like surviving an encounter with a great white only to get thrown into a river of piranhas. Good luck with that, Red. Oh my goodness, crushing it! Spinning kick to the gut, stringing together some big moves here. Yeah, she's a little bundle of energy right now. Elbow smash! Snap suplex. Whether it's in a ring, an octagon, or on the big screen, Ronda Rousey has truly embodied her nickname, the baddest woman on the planet. And that's a title she puts on the line every time she fights. Ooh, what impact. Ronda Rousey got out of there in time. Oh, caught off guard, this might be it. She got the shoulder up in time. Clearly not enough damage done. Anticipated that attack perfectly. Rousey able to counter beautifully. Gotta be careful not to get counted out here. Whoa! Byron touched on Ronda Rousey's nickname is the baddest woman on the planet. Her Olympic, MMA, and WWE careers certainly support the name that the public gave her, but it does put a huge target on her back. Yeah, but Rousey welcomes any challenge, Cole. 15 consecutive MMA victories, all by submission or knockout, all but one concluding in the first round. And she's continued that dominance in WWE. Any woman who wants to challenge Ronda's moniker has more guts than brains. Lost in the corner right now. Oh, oh, no, another oh, one for good measure. Drop kick from behind. <laughs> Stump puller oh. leg snap. Well, that's going to hurt. Tear your hamstring. She's in control. Exploder suplex. Back inside the ring. Side headlock applied. Oh, and a right hand for good measure. Oh, she turns it around. Oh, what a right. Yeah, that's some attitude behind it. Oh, on the apron, lifting it up into the ring. Red setting up for something big. Hold on, what is Samoa Joe doing out here? Did you find your friend yet? Huh? Where is he? Answer me. I don't know where he went. This is not my problem. Here comes Ronda from behind. Piper's pit. And that'll do it, Ronda. Has qualified for the Money in the Bank ladder match, albeit under somewhat controversial circumstances. Controversial. Red should have stayed focused on her opponent. That's on her. Well, it appears Ronda Rousey is also somewhat frustrated with how things went down. Hey, a win's a win. And if Trey hadn't run away like a coward, this never would have happened. Maybe Red needs to have a talk with her best friend.